Today we're going to see Wonders vs. the Seagull. Junior and Patege left the job at Wall just five days before the Premier League season. Gary O'Neill came in the day before, only to have four days with the Wanderers and lose 1-0 to United, 23 shots in that game alone. But I believe the Wolverhampton should have had a penalty. Well, as for the Seagulls, they beat Luton Town 4-1 at the Amex Stadium. I think the Seagulls could be really up against it today. Even though winning 4-1 last week, it was a pretty good game from the Seagulls' perspective. Wolves and Brighton games combined with 50 shots in total. That is unbelievable but as i said i believe the seagulls could be really up against it today with the wonders having 23 shots against united at old traffic so guys anyway let's go and see what happens <laughs>
Just put on TV and then on it. Please, I'll be on that song on should do. But fingers crossed we go. Come out again.
I'm back on coach range to go home and um, finish Brighton for all rank and one. Uh, could have been with a different ball game if that ball rank and goal was not side. Um, and I'm happy to go away with three points. Um, Super Cup was they scored 10 goals against them in their last two games. To the last of the last bits of the MX. Hey, let's see how this season goes, but um, guys, if you have enjoyed it, it would be quite fun if you have subscribed for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao.